Thank you for tuning in this Sunday evening. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. From the sideline, our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. You'll see the West All-Stars and the Orlando Magic. And it's going to be the Magic off the tip. Now a look at the West All-Stars starting lineup. They've got LeBron James. Curry is out there with Luka Doncic. And then there's Antetokounmpo. And it's Jokic in at the five spot. Now here is McGrady. It's good. And that'll start us off already. You can feel the tension in this arena. Boy, I tell you, you're right. You can feel this one looking like it's going to be a tight one throughout Curry. It's blocked by Shaq. Love seeing O'Neal use his body to come up with those blocks. An imposing force and a pretty consistent defender as well. Four on the shot clock. No one near Doncic as he lets it fly. A three-pointer off the mark. And it's Orlando's ball. Here's Hardaway. Feeds it to McGrady. Howard trying to free himself up. And there's Tracy McGrady, the assist from Hardaway. And Hardaway, Penny Hardaway. Boy, what a terrific passer he is. Great floor awareness and does an excellent job finding the open man. Now, here's Doncic. That shot missing. On the wing, Tracy McGrady. Money from the wing. McGrady's got six. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Jokic against Shaquille O'Neal. Jokic passes to Doncic. Curry wide open. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Took a little time, but they get one to go. Maybe they're warmed up now. It's been a quick start for Orlando. Outside Hardaway. Inside. And it's sent back by Jokic. Outstanding timing from Jokic there. Then the superb reach to wipe away the shot. Doncic kicks to Curry. Back to Doncic. Buried from 15 feet out. Excellent feed from Steph Curry. McGrady outside. From the arc. And James pulls it down. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the West All-Stars. They trail by one. Giannis right side. Curry on the wing. Five on the clock. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. And Curry certainly is clever and crafty. Trickery is part of his arsenal when he gets inside. I mean, I like seeing him do his thing close to the basket. Now, here is O'Neal. Yep, it counts. And so here are the West Alston. And we've got an update here, so let's catch up with David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, I did speak earlier with the Magic's head coach. I asked about Steph Curry and the problems he poses to defense that fans don't know about. Coach said everyone knows about the shooting, but he's the most slippery guy in the league, too. Constant movement, dips in and around screens all the time. He's hard to locate. And they will have to do their best not to lose Curry in this one. Guys? Okay, David, much appreciated. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. 
Orlando leading. McGrady outside. Here's Hill. And it's sent back by Jokic. Shots good by Shaq. Here's Curry. Five points in the game. Ranjic outside. Jokic passes to Giannis. Kicks to Doncic. Shot clock at five. You know, he looks a little off kilter to me this quarter. Still trying to find his rhythm. O'Neal. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And here's the West with the ball. It's a five point game. Curry finds Doncic. Boy, just cannot buy a bucket, guys. And tell you what, that's a painful quarter for him, and it's painful for me to watch, too. Shaq misses. Yeah, and that was lining up to be a huge alley-oop, but they just couldn't quite connect. And you know, guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. Now here is Hardaway after the miss from Stephen Curry. Now Hardaway. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Outside Hill. And the rebound goes to the West All-Stars. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. Curry passes to Giannis. And that one drops for him. Yeah, Curry is so impressive. His peripheral vision is what makes him unique in addition to his ball handling skills. He does a nice job setting up his teammates and knows how to get them the ball when they're open. And here comes the break. Doncic dishes to Giannis. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That's on Dwight Howard. And you don't ever want to get into the habit of letting the offense get to the rim. Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. I mean, that's the message they were sending with that foul. Nothing easy inside. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That's good from Antetokounmpo. You know, since entering the league at age 18, Antetokounmpo has really grown. The Greek freak, now one of the league's premier talents, no doubt. Both free throws good from Antetokounmpo. And here is Hardaway. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Outside Hill. Here's McGrady. Misses the three. And so Giannis will bring it up for the West All-Stars. They trail by one. Outside Curry. A miss that time. Would have put him up. There's some defense for you. For someone who's as good at shooting the three ball as he is, you, you need a defender who's equally good at guarding against him. And Adel Kumpo's seven foot three wingspan, extraordinary. I mean, he's effective in rejecting shots, bothering shots, and stealing the ball. He knew what he wanted to do all along. The teardrop. And it's Orlando's ball. He lobs up the alley -oop pass, and then Hardaway with the dunk. Yeah, and you got to respect the size McGrady has. Easily seen over the defense there to spot the open man. Here's the floater, and Doncic lays it in. Just focusing on the task at hand, that's all you can do. Yeah, these teams trading punches right now. I mean, it's table tennis. Back and forth we go. Now here's Shaq. He's got six. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. And O'Neal clearly one of the biggest human beings you'll ever see. A mammoth of a man. About a seventh of a ton. And yet, unstoppable. 
and a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the West All-Stars. That mid-range shot has been a weapon for them up to this point, fellas. They've established their presence in the paint tonight. Also, a lot of their scoring to this point coming from down low. That's good for O'Neal. So Orlando going with an almost entirely new group here. Circle is checked in for Howard. Lewis comes in for Hill. Anderson, he's checked in for McGrady. And Nelson is subbed in for Hardaway. He hits one and misses one each at the line. You can tell that miss at the line might stick with him for a while. Always hurts to miss a chance to take the lead. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Lewis passes to Anderson. Good ball movement here by the Magic. Here's Turkaloo. He can't get that one to fall. Now the West All-Stars the other way. Nobody near George. Off target with his three. And now, running up the court, Lewis pushing it up. And the basket by Turkaloo. Well, the first thought from the D there was to protect the rim, so good idea to take the three in transition. George passes to Sabonis. Trying to answer back, but that three is off the mark. Orlando leading by three. Nelson with it. And there's the feed to O'Neal. And stolen by Lillard. To the middle. And oh, here we go with George. Nobody back. Boy, you have to respect the quickness of Lillard now because he's excellent at using his hands to complement those quick feet to come up with steals. Nelson, the pass to Turkaloo. Back to Nelson. Over Sabonis. Here's Shaq. And there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. O'Neal's got nine. And it takes a lot to knock O'Neal off balance. A massive player who just fins off the D with ease. Three-pointer, Lillard. O'Neal with the rebound. Shaq's got eight rebounds in this game. To the inside, here's Turkaloo. He shoots again, and O'Neal finishes inside. 11 points in the game. His shooting has been outstanding. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. Lillard outside. Simmons passes to Sabonis. Anderson against George. And he makes that one. When PG-13 is feeling it, he can be an absolute monster from mid-range. Turkaloo against Simmons. Great positioning on the putback. And the Magic lead by five. And he's starting to show that killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. Brown outside. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. Shard Lewis picks one up. Well, I like the fact that the energy that Brown plays with makes him a guy that does a good job getting to the line. The West All-Stars have been perfect at the line so far, albeit just two for two. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. And the vertical that Brown has is uh, quite impressive. As relentless a finisher that you'll find in this league. Here's what Orlando's going with right now. Grant, he's checked in for O'Neal. And it's Scott in for Lewis. And Brown drops them both. Orlando with the ball. Three-point lead. Now, here is Nelson. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. 
Here's Grant, and that one good. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Well, listless and lifeless at the defensive end. I mean, especially inside. They've really got to pick up that interior defense. Taking matters into his own hands. Yeah, we didn't expect to see that kind of finish. And you know, guys, when your point guard is making explosive plays at the rim, I really do think it sets the tone for the rest of the team. Here's Nelson. The West All-Stars getting their last shot to go. And here we go. George heading. Oh! oh. Yeah, you know, George really enjoys being in the air. I mean, this guy has great body control and bounce, and his slams at times can be absolutely sick. Now, here's Scott. Nelson looking around, fires the three. It's hauled in by George. They've been sensational on the backboard to start this game. Yeah, sensational is a really good word for it. They're tearing it up on the glass. Guys, what a tight start to the game this has been. And it's still in the first half. This could be a wild one. And it's the Magic with the ball. The West All-Stars getting their last shot to go. Perry's the long-range jumper. And the Magic lead by two. Boy, Anderson can really stroke that thing from behind the arc. When he's in rhythm, he lets it fly confident. George against Grant. And it's George missing. You know, I think the effort on defense there has everything to do with why he missed that shot. Well done. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Anderson outside. Passes to Grant. Clock at six. Over Simmons. No good from Grant. Defense made an impact right there. Definitely got him uncomfortable going up with it. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Magic lead by two. And the second quarter about to get started. We'll be back in just a moment. second quarter fairly close game so far and from what we've seen from Orlando what do you guys see just cashing in on second chance opportunities that's how they built this early lead Boy, grinding it out on the glass they've really been working for those points and here's George he'll bring it up for the West All-Stars trailing by two and a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. So on the floor for Orlando. Grant is out there with Turkaloo. Then there's Scott, and it's Francis in at the shooting guard. Here's Francis following the basket by Chris Paul. Pass to Skyer. And Grant now top of the key. Pass to Skyle. Down to five on the shot clock. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the contact. Yeah, the defender all over. He got him good there. I mean, that's why the shot was so far off. The Magic shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Taking two shots. And the first one drops. Howard's check in for Hito Turkaloo. Good on both. Already a very confident player. Knocking down those free throws only fuels that. And so here are the West All-Stars. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Hey, guys, if you can believe it, before Jalen Brown went to the draft, one executive said the Cal Berkeley star was too smart. Brown says when athletes are also informative, it can intimidate. We get pushback for our outside interests. 
The whole shut up and dribble movement is big, and I'm a part of that movement. Guys? Strong story, DA, there. Thanks. Here is Paul following the bucket by Orlando. Poked away. And here we go. Here's Skiles. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. Attacking in transition, the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. In a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Magic. I'll tell you one thing. They've cashed in on a lot of second chance opportunities here in the first half. Something else they've done right so far from the get-go tonight is, is run. I mean, so much of their offense has come off the fast break. We're about a minute and a half into the second quarter now. Here's Doncic, and it's sent back by Howard. Excellent timing by Howard. He knows exactly when to jump to deny shot attempts. And there's the pass to Francis. Here's Grant, and they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. They've settled into a nice groove offensively here in the second. Yeah, and that field goal percentage zooming upwards is now above 50%, which is pretty strong. Catching up on changes for the West, Antetokounmpo comes in for Ben Simmons, and LeBron subbed in for Paul George. The free throw drops for Grant. Yeah, a nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. My kind of hoops. Straight ahead, playing downhill and physical. Paul finds James off his leg, and it's whistle to kick. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again. And those are plays that get you in front and keep you in front. The Magic making a switch here. Hills checked in. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. Giannis passes to James. Just five on the clock. The West All-Stars need to get a shot off here. And it's Doncic missing. And then they continue to control the glass. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. And the wide open shot from Paul. And no good. The dry spell continuing for him. Orlando leading by eight. Over to the wing. Outside Hill. To the right side. Here's Francis. They get it back. And so onto the Kumba will bring it up for the West All-Stars. Paul's shot is off. Here's Francis. Changes up. Off target there. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Boy, what a brilliant find by Doncic. Here's Skiles. Defended by Paul. And Skiles gets it to go. Skiles has got the lead up to eight now for the Magic. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Giannis passes to LeBron. Looks for Paul. Gets it to him. And it's blocked. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. Passes it to Francis. From past the arc, it's rebounded by the West. Paul for three. It's hauled in by the Magic. Howard's got rebound number eight now on the night. Here's Francis to the paint. And Howard with the stuff. Howard determined to punish the rim and scare off defenders when he gets inside. Watch out now. 
Now James. Doncic outside. Good, and the assist goes to James. Doncic has got his third bucket of the night. Boy, you got to love that assist by LeBron. Here's Skiles. Defended by Paul. Skiles' shot is off. James, the pass to Antetokounmpo, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Now, just a five-point magic lead. And Giannis is a beast, the Greek freak, a dominant player on the offensive end. Now a timeout called by Orlando. And as the coaches go to the clipboard to outline their strategy during the timeout, the players getting a chance to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's key to staying fresh all the way to the final whistle. And Kevin, it really is. And every one of these players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially uh, towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up. So for the West, Jokic comes in for Gobert. And it's Stephen Curry in for Chris Paul. Out of bounds, Out of bounds. it'll be the West All-Stars ball. West. Here's West now. It's a five-point game. Donchich outside. Pass to LeBron. Back to Donchich. Yes, it's good. Good for basket number four. He's now four for ten. Boy, you're playing with fire anytime you leave somebody open on James' team. I mean, LeBron, his court vision, outstanding. Now here is Hardaway. Howard drives in, and it's sent back by Jokic. Out of bounds as Orlando keeps possession. Doncic comes with the double team. Here's Hill. Uses the glass to finish the lane. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. The West All-Stars with the ball. Trailing by five. Hill against James. Outside Curry. Six on the shot clock. And here's Doncic from the arc. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got four assists now tonight. Bobbed up there for Howard. And Howard with the stuff. Great timing and recognition as Howard is able to go up for the alley-oop. Doncic against McGrady. Up it goes, and the Magic lead is cut down now to just two points with that basket from Doncic. And he's clearly led the way offensively. The question is, can they ride him and get back into it? Now, here is McGrady. Six points for him. And the well is running dry for him right now. Nothing falling. And, you know, you can sense his frustration. This is going to be a test of his resolve here. And he's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. Hey, guys, I know I'm stating the obvious here, but those could be an important two points considering how close this game is. Lewis gets the bucket. And that's what the pump fake's there for. Get your man off his feet and drive right around him. McGrady against Doncic. Here's James. Here's Jokic. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. Jokic has got it all tied up now for the West All-Stars. Now a timeout called by Orlando. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. Jacks checked in for Orlando. Anderson comes in for Hill. The West All-Star is also changing it up. Zabonis comes in for Antetokounmpo. And Lillard subbed in for LeBron. Hardaway passes to O'Neal. And he gets it to go. O'Neal doing a nice job using his body so well whenever he has the ball. A top-tier score for sure. 
for Orlando they have shot a good percentage from the free throw line so far they've made five out of six. That's good from O'Neal. And here is Curry. He's got five. Lillard with it. Pass to Sabonis. Kicks it out to Lillard. From deep. Trains the three-pointer. Sabonis making sure to pass it where his teammates are open. And that's just being a good passer there. McGrady against Curry. Hardaway with a wide open look. Good. And it's McGrady who picks up the assist. McGrady's got three assists now in this one. Three-pointer Lillard. They get it back. Count it. And the Orlando lead has been cut to just one on the basket from Jokic. Really starting to find himself now, guys, after getting shut out in the first quarter. Down low. And then Hardaway with the dunk. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there. Sure. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. Outstanding distribution there. I mean, what impressive passing ability. McGrady outside. O'Neal kicks to McGrady. That three off the mark. Oof, rough shooting night tonight, but you can't fault him for the effort. Curry, that's good for his third bucket. Now three for six from the field. Well, guys, this first half has been about as tightly contested as you could hope for. There have been a lot of lead changes. My goodness. Now, here is McGrady. He has six. One of the things you've got to admire and respect about him is his aggressiveness at the offensive end, always in attack mode. The pass to Doncic. To the middle. And Sabonis the bucket on the assist by Doncic. Sabonis has got the lead up to one now for the West All-Stars. Mug Crady with the ball. Sabonis defending. And that one's good. McGrady. McGrady's got 11 points. And, and how about getting a hand up on McGrady, especially when he's looking to shoot from the outside? Curry looking it over. And it's sent back by O'Neal. And up the court come the Magic on the break. From 15 feet away. Outside for Lewis. The shot will not fall. Now the West All-Stars the other way. A clear look for Curry. And misses it off the right side of the rim. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. O'Neal trying to break free. And then Hardaway with the dunk. Taking matters into his own hand. Yeah, we didn't expect to see that kind of finish. And you know, guys, when your point guard is making explosive plays at the rim, I really do think it sets the tone for the rest of the team. Don't let his height fool you. Lillard can rise up with the best of them. Lewis on the way, defended by Sabonis. And the whistle blows as the basket counts in a three-point play chance right here. One free throw coming up. The Magic have shot six or seven at the line. Orlando making some changes. Turkaloos checked in for Lewis, and it's Scott in for Anderson. Then for the West All-Stars, Simmons checked in for Jokic. Brown comes in for Doncic. And it's Paul George in for Steph Curry. That's good from O'Neal. Now, here's George. Six points for him. 104 left in the first half. Fires from the line. Goes back up. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's on Hito Turkoglu. Can't afford to be too handsy with Sabonis. He's very good at forcing the issue and getting these calls. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Take a break. 
Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for him. I look at Sabonis as a terrific stretch four. He's a guy who can play either power forward or center, and he has excellent length and a nice touch. And Sabonis drops them both. Magic leading by three. 52 seconds left to play here in the half. Here's McGrady. Here's O'Neal. And taken away by Brown. Lillard surveying the D. Over Turkaloo. O'Neal with the rebound. Shaq's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Left side, Scott. And it goes down two points. And that's definitely a shot that he has in his arsenal. And so George will bring it up for the West All-Stars. It's a five-point game. 15 seconds left to play in the first half. Shot clock at six. From deep, sinks the three-pointer. George has got nine. Man, you've got to like the way George puts the right touch and arc on his shots from deep. He's an outstanding, outstanding shooter from range. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Magic out in front, leading by just two. Stay with us, folks. We'll get back just after halftime to start the third quarter. We've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. Really an incredible game from Shaquille O'Neal. Well, with a double-double in hand through two quarters, you can just imagine what his stat line will look like at the end of this one. Yeah, he's got that locked-in look in his eyes tonight, and he's not going to start taking it easy. I think he's going to be going hard until that final whistle blows. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. And the West All-Stars, looking at who they've got, Anda Jakumpa out there with Jokic. Then there's Stephen Curry. Then there's Luka Doncic. And it's James in at the three spot. I wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the backboard. It's clearly been their edge. And in a close game like this, you look for every edge you can find. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent passing. Here's Curry after Tracy McGrady's score. High arcing shot and the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. Absolutely awesome to watch Antetokounmpo rise up for these throwdowns. I mean, it's really quite easy for him. O'Neal, the putback, controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. And the Magic lead by four. You know we talk about it all the time, guys. Those second chance buckets, always the result of that extra effort. James outside. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got four assists now tonight. I love how quick he makes decisions. I mean, if a shot is there for him, LeBron is not going to think twice or hesitate. He'll let it fly. A shot by McGrady, no good. Hey, how about imagining if they were hitting their shots, how big the lead could be? But so far, that's not been the case. Well, I like this execution coming out of the half. Solid. Three for four from the field so far. Here's Hardaway. After Luka Doncic's bucket. And there's the defensive three-second call. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. 
the, the defensive awareness, the timing. When you have to face a defender that can reject you like that, it can alter your approach. For Orlando, they have been coming through at the charity strip. They've made seven of their eight attempts. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. And he shows the focus there, nails the technical. And Hardaway's nickname came from his grandmother. She was calling him pretty, but with that southern draw, it sounded like Penny. Grant Hill on the wing. And he's going up for the alley-oop. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. There's not much that Heal does not do well. He does a bunch of good things, including spotting the open man and getting the ball to him right away. Now, here's Doncic. 16 points for him. Shaq against Jokic. He kicks it to Doncic. Five to shoot. This one for three. And it's Orlando with the rebound. They've led by as much as 10. Curry brings the double. Hardaway finds Hill. That drops and it comes off the assist from Hardaway. Now it's a five-point magic lead. And with the height to see over people and the peripheral vision to do it quickly, Penny with the perfect setup. Doncic against McGregor. And Doncic gets it to go. Magic leading by three. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. Here's Shaq. The West All-Stars pull it in. Jokic has got six rebounds here tonight and a wide open look for James. A three-pointer no good. James has gone two for five tonight. Launches the three and it's McGrady that time on the assist from Hardaway. McGrady's got 18 points in the game. One triple for him in the first half. Now he's hit enough. To the inside. Found it, and the Orlando lead has been cut down to just four points in the bucket from Jokic. Well, you got to do more than that to stop Jokic. I mean, this guy is a master at converting through tough defense. Hardaway passes to O'Neal, and Shaq with the slam. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then, Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Boy, picture perfect teamwork that time, guys. One guy sacrificing for the other. That's how you succeed in this league. And it's Doncic missing. He had a couple in the first, but so far he's been unable to get uncorked here. McGrady outside. Inside, O'Neal. Good. And it's McGrady who picks up the assist. O'Neal's got six here in this quarter. And he is really in a zone right now, playing and scoring with confidence. Curry passes to Giannis. Jokic kicks to Doncic. Over McGrady. That's short off the rim. And they hold a huge advantage on the backboard. And that's been the key to this lead. I mean, they've really dominated the glass. Curry against Hardaway. O'Neal inside. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. No question. He got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. And, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Magic? Guys, their play close to the hoop has been great all game. And Shoot also, two. their second chance points have been a story all night as well. That's just pure effort and hustle. That's good from O'Neal. Rudy Gobert, he's checked in for the West. Paul comes in for Doncic. That one misses. 
And so James will bring it up for the West All-Stars. They trail by nine points. It's good. Paul's got six points. You cannot underestimate Chris Paul's ability to finish through contact just because he's small. I mean, he's as tough as they come. Here's Francis. To the paint, here's O'Neal. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. O'Neal's got nine points now in just the second half. Now a timeout called by the West All-Stars. Definitely not pleased with their rebounding at the defensive end. The, the number of putbacks they've allowed has been terrible. I'm sure that's what he's going to address during this timeout. Anderson, he's checked in for Orlando. to the Kumbo looking it over and there's the whistle on the shot took the foul shot misses he'll be shooting two there's the call it's a foul on Orlando this is his second trip to the line in this one throw good Giannis no good on the second so he hits one of two Orlando leading by eight Francis passes to Nelson. Knocked away. Passes it to O'Neal. Gobert brings the double team. Six to shoot. The shot missing. James with some nice D. And here we go. Fast break. Paul's got it. Unable to get that one. And it's the Magic taking it the other way. And Anderson kicks to Nelson. And again, it's the Magic from deep. And that's the shot Nelson's always relied on. And it served him well. He works nonstop on the perimeter, finding the space he needs to get good looks from beyond. Now, here's Curry. He's got seven. Kicks it out to James. Feeds it to Gobert. Grant gets the rebound. Grant's got his fifth rebound in this one. Inside. And there's Shaq. That's good on the assist by Anderson. O'Neal's got the lead up to 13 now for the match. And so here are the West All-Stars. Here's Paul. Six points for him. Over Nelson. Paul can't get it to go. Magic leading by 13 to the inside fast break here we go takes a three Orlando grabs the miss Grant's got six rebounds in the game their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively pass to Francis ring shot on the way Giannis grabs the miss Francis has gone one for five from the field 20% Curry's got nine points. You know, when you see Antetokounmpo make a pass like that, it tells you just how much he's matured and grown as a player and decision maker. Now, here is Nelson. Kicks it to Anderson. To the middle, here's O'Neal. And Shaq with the slam. Yeah, I mean, maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Hey, they've got a nice, comfortable lead here, fellas. Might as well keep it simple. Do it a plain, simple one-hander, just like pound cake. Here's Francis following the basket by Stephen Curry. Now a timeout called by Orlando. That was a good time to call a timeout to try to settle everybody down and get back into their offensive rhythm. They've been coughing up the rock an awful lot.
and some changes here for the West All-Stars. Sabonis, he's checked in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. Jalen Brown comes in for James. And it's Paul George in for Steph Curry. Now here's Turkoglu. And DeMontis Sabonis pulls it down. Sabonis has got five rebounds tonight. Here's Brown. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. And, you know, really, guys, Brown is very talented at knocking down shots, even when getting hit. He's gone two for two at the line so far. Lillard's checked in for the West. And it's Nelson with the ball, bringing it up now for the Orlando Magic. They're leading by eight. Lots of room. Kept alive. Here's Turkaloo shooting foul. As the whistle blows, he'll shoot two free throws. It's going to be on Rudy Gobert. For Orlando, they have shot nine of 11 at the free throw line. Pino Turkaloo. Two shots. Shooting two. And he makes the first. And so Turkaloo nails both of them. Well, he's certainly been on target with the free throws. Such an advantage when your bigs can knock them down from the lot. Anderson against George. Over Lewis. Here's Gobert. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And That's he'll good. have a chance at the line to make it a three-point play. One shot. He knows his job. Gobert is there to own the glass and cash in on as many second chance opportunities as he can. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. A free throw drops for Gobert. An improved free throw shooter compared to his earlier seasons. Nice to see Gobert attack his weakness. Here's Skiles. Covered by Lillard. Anderson wide open. Another miss by Orlando. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. Howard's checked in for Richard Lewis. Here's George off the left rim and out. Magic leading by seven. Pass to Anderson. Finished off the break. Anderson's got five now. Great teamwork punctuated by a strong finish. That is the perfect fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. Lillard with the bucket. And if you look at the stats for unassisted jump shot percentage, Lillard is always around the top. He can drain those pull-up jumpers as well as anybody in our league. Now, here's Scott. Now, Turkaloo. Count it. Turkaloo's got four this quarter. And not quite as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half. Sticking to the high percentage shots. Playing smart with the lead. Here's a bonus. Back to Lillard. Over Turkaloo. Lillard misses. Lillard's got three of his nine shots to fall. Here's Skiles. Gobert pulls it in. Gobert's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. 
Lillard from outside, and it's Lillard again missing. And even against defense as tight as that, you almost expect him to still bury those. Here's Skiles, defended by Sabonis. Skiles shot is off. The West All-Stars with the ball. Eight-point game. And they pick up two. And it's really obvious that George has put a ton of time into improving his hand. I mean, you never know what he's going to do with the ball in his hands. And most times, it's pretty good. Now, here's Anderson. He's got five. Howard in the post. Go bear on him. Howard can't hit. Howard's gone two of five from the floor. Brown the pass to Lillard. Outside, George. Just five to shoot. Shoots the three. He scores a sixth bucket from the floor with that one. He's shot the ball 11 times. He can certainly stroke it from deep. The three-pointer is not a shot that George is going to pass up. Here's Skiles. Covered by Lillard. Down low, Howard. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Nice job that time using that strong body of his inside. Once Howard has positioning, I think you got to wrap him up. First trip to the line for him here. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. You know, Howard, a physical and muscular, authoritative big guy who intimidates most nights. Um, his physicality, very impressive. And so Howard nails both of them. To the paint here's Simmons and it's good assisting on the play was Lillard yeah you know Lillard has been so good at finding the open man puts a lot of zip on his passes and he knows he's responsible for getting his teammates the ball and we'll be back with you shortly And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. Here's McGrady. Scott is out there with Hill. Then it's Tracy McGrady. Then there's Hardaway. And it's Howard in at the center position. That's who's out there for Orlando. Here's McGrady. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. And so here are the West All-Stars. They trail by three, and George with the stuff. Boy, a nice show of strength that time from Paul George, absorbing the hit and still carving out space to get the shot to go down. Doncic has checked in for Jalen Brown. tied up with that one and every single season Paul George has kicked his game up another level I think he's a premier two way forward who gets it done at both ends back to Hardaway oh yes he did five up and five down for him so far and that's right in his wheelhouse looking to make an impact when it counts. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. Miller against Hardaway. Good D by Hardaway. And it's Orlando's ball. 
13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Well, you gotta love seeing McGrady when he's hot. An amazing score from any spot on the floor. Lillard outside. Donjic outside. Trying to come right back with the three of his own. It's no good. Here's Hardaway. And that one hits back iron. And so it's Doncic with it. He brings it up for the West All-Stars. It's a five-point game. Now the pass to Jokic. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. Doncic has got his fifth assist in this one. Inside, here's McGrady. And he uses the glass on the way. Up. McGrady's got five points now this quarter. Efficiency has been the hallmark right now down the stretch. He is making the most of his opportunity. And Doncic gets it to go. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. And it's sent back by Jokic. Hard away against Lillard. Here's Jokic. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It's on Dwight Howard. You know, it took a little time for Jokic to understand how to draw contact and get himself to the foul line, but he's figured it out now. First free throw is good. Jokic is one of those new breed of positionless players on any given night. He could lead the team in points, rebounds, or assists, or maybe all three, triple-double like. O'Neal's checked in for the match. The West All-Stars also with the sub. James is checked in, and Jokic drops them both. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Hardaway kicks to Howard. Back to Hardaway. Oh, he's going up for the alley-oop here and shot with the slam. And how about the reach of O'Neal there? A huge target for his teammates on these alley-oops. Lillard fires away from way outside. That misses. Had a chance to tie it there. Magic leading by three. On the wing, Tracy McGrady. Guarded by Doncic. Here's McGrady. And again, it's Orlando converting. McGrady, as accomplished a mid-range shooter as we have in the game, keeps that high release point on the jump shot. To the inside. LeBron dishes to Simmons. Doncic against Hardaway. Down to five on the shot clock. Offensive rebound. Jokic passes to Simmons. Over Shaq. No good from Simmons. And it's Orlando's ball. Leading by five. Simmons against Hardaway. Here's Shaq. And the bucket is good. Three-point play chance here for him. And they've done some nice work as we've come down the stretch here in the final quarter. You can feel the sense of urgency they have to get this thing closed out as soon as possible. The West making some changes. Giannis Antetokounmpo is checked in for Ben Simmons. And Steph Curry is subbed in for Damian Lillard. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. The free throw off from O'Neal. Out of the Kumbo up top. He's guarded by Howard. Doncic. Good. And it's Giannis picking up the assist. Yes. 22 points for Luka Doncic. Orlando leading by five. To the middle. Here's Howard. And the layup's good off the glass. You know, this is where Howard does the most damage. With his height and length and athleticism, how do you guard him inside? Jokic passes to Doncic. Craps in the tray. Doncic has got 25 points in the game. 
and those are the types of shots down the stretch that win you ball game. Here's McGrady and the powerful one-handed slam. And I like seeing McGrady rise up for the dunk. Has amazing leaping ability and good reach, too. He makes it look easy. And the West All-Stars have possession. They trail by six. Jokic inside, guarded by O'Neal. And it's sent back by Howard. A good job by him on the glass here tonight. Plus eight in that department. Hardaway for three. A putback. It's good on the putback. And it's an eight-point Orlando lead. Sensational at hitting the glass. Howard has fantastic timing when he goes after those rebounds. Now a timeout called by the West All-Stars. One guy has been getting it done is Shaquille O'Neal. And he's just attacking the rim with force here. They need to try and deny him the ball in the paint to keep him away from the basket. Updated from the sideline. Let's swing it over to David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Frank Vogel talk to his team during the break. He said, We're too concerned with their shooters right now. We've got to close off the inside. They are gutting us. He pleaded with his guys. Come on, let's take a stand. Kevin? Jokic passes to Curry. And it's sent back by Howard. Shot clock at five. Here's James. And it's Orlando with the rebound. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Hill looking around. It's tipped. And the ball travels out of his hands. It was last touched by Jokic. And he made the right read on that play, but just couldn't secure the steal. You know, fellas, one second quicker, and that's going the other way. On defense, the West All-Stars. Eight-point game. And then Hardaway with the dunk. And how about O'Neal zipping passes over to his guys, using that height to find open teammates. Doncic dishes to Giannis. Good D by Howard. And physically, there's no doubt they've been the stronger team. A plus-10 rebound advantage tells you all you need to know. And there's the basket. Whistle blows and a chance for a three-point play. Going to the line for one. He's certainly been their go-to guy when it matters most. He's trying to close this one out. The free throw off from O'Neal. And so it's Jokic with it. He brings it up for the West All-Stars. Down by 12. And the shot goes in. LeBron can score from anywhere, but he's most effective close to the hoop. Very skilled in the paint. And here is McGrady. By the way, that's a two-pointer. They get it again. Here's Howard. And the rejection by Giannis. Here's Jokic. Good, and the assist goes to Giannis. Giannis has got four assists now tonight. And this is why Jokic is a star in this league. I mean, he's a top-tier center, and he can carry a team when he needs to. Passes it to O'Neal. And the dunk by O'Neal. Oh, he just punches that one down with a fury. He rubs it in a little deeper with the hanging finish. Guys, they're not backing off at all, are they? The Magic making a switch here. Nelson's checked in. Donna 
Bulls kicks to Jokic. Here's Curry with the three. Nailed from three-point land. Man, I have great appreciation for the IQ of Stephen Curry. I mean, once the ball hits his hands, guys, you know he's thinking about letting it go. Now a timeout called by Orlando. And team strategies closely guarded. One aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. Yeah, typically, there's some type of adjustment made out of a timeout. It might be major or it could be just a slight tweak. the New Balance player of the game, Shaq. And guys, no doubt who our pick was going to be. Uh, he's made everyone else on the court look like they're playing at half speed. It's been total domination, and you can't help but just sit back and admire that performance. He sure has given this crowd a treat tonight. This kind of performance only cements his status as a fan favorite. Nelson with it. To the inside, O'Neal. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. At the line, you are matching Shaquille O'Neal. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw, no good. And he has been grinding a way to get himself to the line. It hasn't always turned into points, but he's doing a lot of the dirty work for them. No good at the stripe this time. Second misses also. And missing opportunities here to extend that lead at the free throw line this half. Curry way outside. The long distance three is buried. Now just a four-point Orlando lead. And I love the tenacity, guys. He simply can will his way into games at times and exert his presence. Shaq down low. He's against Jokic. Another miss by Orlando. And it's the West All-Stars ball. They've outscored him 10 points to 2 during this run. And to Takumbo. And it's sent back by Howard. A nice shot there by Antetokounmpo. And the fourth quarter just has not been kind. Only one bucket and five attempts. McGrady passes to Howard. Now here is Nelson. McGrady outside. Six on the shot clock. And the foul called on Antetokounmpo. That's his first foul. Here's McGrady. Tell you what, like with most players, when Doncic is aggressive on defense, it makes a difference and causes his coaches to smile. And the basket by Curry. And with a limitless jump shot, the elusive ball handling skills, Curry can get a bucket pretty much whenever he wants. Hits it from three-point range. McGrady's got 12 points now in the quarter. It just seems like the more he touches it, the more the lead grows. Curry passes to Jokic. Giannis right side, the 11-footer, and it's wide right. It's off the rim. 
And, and offensively, he has been a liability more than he's helped this quarter. Offensive rebound. Makes it off the glass. O'Neal's got 42 in the game. Boy, a dominant big man is O'Neal. Superb control inside. And this dude will feast on the interior. Orlando leading by five. Here's Hill. Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got 13 rebounds in the game. Seated. Here's Doncic. It counts. And the foul. And it's going to be on Tracy McGrady. Doncic not afraid of the moment. Actually embraces the spotlight. This guy steps up big when needed most. Just a great rhythm at the line, whether it's a big lead in the first quarter or with the game hanging in the balance. Now a timeout, timeout, timeout. called by Orlando. All-Stars. Giannis has got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Here's Curry. O'Neal with the rebound. Orlando leading. Hill kicks to O'Neal. He dishes it to Howard. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. It goes on Giannis Antetokounmpo. An aggressive player who draws attention. Howard is used to getting hit by the defense and plays quite well through contact. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He hits the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he gets them both, and it's a four-point ball game. And he steps up and knocks them down, making it a two-possession game. Inside, here's Doncic. And Doncic throws it down. Boy, this is who Doncic is. This is what we've seen from him. A scorer who can take over games easily. McGrady against Doncic. Nelson from outside. West All-Stars with the rebound. Giannis has got 13 rebounds in the game. Seated. He's so clutch. When the pressure is at its highest, that's when he's at his very best. Now, here is McGrady. Releases. Once again, off the mark, Orlando. Curry kicks to LeBron. It falls! Well, they're having major trouble dealing with LeBron. LeBron's gone four of nine in field goal attempts. Popped up there for Howard. It's so bad. It's a Kumbo. Over in the corner, Doncic. Three pointers off the mark. And you know what? If you're the defense, you got him right where you want him. Let him keep shooting those threes because he's been brutal in this half. And you can't get a bigger bucket than that. Well, that was one two. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. And Frank Vogel wants a timeout. Dishes to Giannis. Good! Man, the attitude of Antetokounmpo. Really impressive. Really what you want to see in your team's best player. He's a guy that doesn't back down when the game gets tight and things are on the line. Now a timeout called by Orlando. They're trailing by two. 
29 seconds left in the fourth. Nelson kicks to McGrady. And a miss there on the triple. And now we've got the intentional foul. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. That's a good foul, though. I like that. I mean, clock management crucial at this time of the game. first and that makes it a three-point lead and so both free throws are good and it's a four-point ball game can't waste any time here no you need a quick bucket and then a quick foul from deep three-point range it's rebounded by Doncic. they foul intentionally that's what they have to do at this point The first one drops, and that puts them up by five. Boy, Doncic plays with such an edge and attitude, and I think it endears him to his teammates and gives them confidence. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a six-point ball game. Good composure from the line there. Those shots sealed. The three from Hill, no good that time. So it's the West All-Stars picking up the win. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, weaker teams might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and pulled it out. Well said. And that about wraps it up. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching this presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.